Hi everybody, I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill. Together we are Belisa. Welcome to our channel. In today's video, we will be replacing this standard 32 inch TV that we have mounted in our van. It does nothing when we're out and about except play DVDs, which is wonderful, but we want something better and we have found it. We are going to be installing this ba bam Vizio 32 inch smart TV. This TV is going to save us power with our solar system because it only takes 39 watts to run this TV and it does everything while this TV takes 42 watts and it does nothing. It requires the DVD player, which is an additional 10 watts in order to even run this TV. But we are going to leave the, t the DVD player in here just in case we want it someday in the future with our new TV. And by the way, this TV is available at your local Best Buy for only $200, including tax. The thing that was so great about it is we went online, ordered our TV, and within 15 minutes, we're able to go to our Best Buy. We just pulled up curbside and picked up our TV. It was so easy. I entered into the box the car we were in and where we were parked right outside they came immediately out they put it in our trunk we were able to open our trunk and close it from inside our car contactless it was great best buy i give you a thumbs up okay let's unbox our vizio d series 32 inch smart tv Okay, friends, here we go. Ready, okay. Be gentle, be gentle. Continue on. Now I'm going to remove the old TV from its mount. Okay, it's going to take two people for me to get the last couple of screws out, so I'm going to need my cameraman's help now. Off with the old and on with the new. The new TV came with its own mounting screws. I need to take them out to mount them on the wall. Let's get this baby up. All right, we almost have this one on. Two more screws. Plug this thing in, give it some power, and get this TV turned on. Alright, plugged in. <laughs> looky, looky! I have been sitting here trying to do this scene now for over 10 minutes but I keep getting interrupted by the UPS man or construction next door or low flying planes. Every once in a while next door I hear Brrr! <laughs> but we're gonna carry on. And if you hear any background noise, just ignore it. 
and focus on me. We just turned off our direct TV service, which was costing us approximately $85 a month because we very rarely watch TV. We also just upgraded our data plan. Our phones now have unlimited service through Verizon and it only cost us an additional $15 a month. In doing that, it gives us 22 gigabytes per phone of high speed data. So I can hotspot my phone and if we need additional data throughout the month, we then can hotspot Bill's phone because he has an additional 22 gigabytes before our service slows down. Okay, we're gonna run through the setup process, see if we can get the TV set up, and then we're gonna hotspot our phone to it. As I was setting up the TV, it came to choose a Wi-Fi network. So I went ahead and I used my phone to turn on my hotspot. I rescanned networks and the best connection is this desktop is actually what it is called for my hotspot on my phone is the one that came up. That is so awesome. All right, it's finalizing our connection. We put in our password does say it could take a couple of minutes. It's already up and set up. That was so easy. It was really easy. All right, so it's making sure the TV is up to date. It says this could take 10 minutes. Please do not turn off or unplug our Vizio TV. So we're gonna let this do its updates and we'll be back. Getting the TV set up and Attaching it to my phone hotspot was really quick and really easy. And then the TV wanted to do a couple of rounds of updates and restart. Just want you to know that took about a half an hour. So just in case you're planning on buying this TV, take that into consideration with your setup time. We are now registering our TV and continuing on. Looks like everything is done and installed. We're gonna try to pull up our YouTube channel first. Let's see. Sign in on your TV, use your Google account. So after putting in our login information to YouTube, we're able to stream our video that we uploaded yesterday. That's amazing. <laughs> we have YouTube running and we can now watch anything and everything on YouTube. Next, we are going to attempt to set up our Netflix. <laughs> I cannot believe it works this easy. We put in our login to Netflix and we're in. It's so amazing. Just give me an hour, guys. Next up, we're gonna sign into our Amazon Prime video. In order to log into Amazon Prime, as soon as I tried to log in, it gave me a code and it told me that from another device, my computer of some sort, I needed to log into my Amazon account, enter my password, and then enter that code. So I just did it right here from my phone, put the code in, and immediately it told me that it was accepted and I clicked continue, and now we're in. <laughs> I can't believe how easy this is, it's so great. All right, so let's pick something. This one's included with Prime, let's see if we can watch Clue. Okay, watch now, there's no cost. We've got ads, <laughs> we're great. Yes! We can also, through the USB port, plug in a USB thumb drive that we have movies that are recorded on and watch movies that way. So we have set up some of our accounts and it went so smoothly. It was really, really easy. This TV is definitely a keeper. We are going to love it and get so much use out of it. And we highly recommend it to you as well. We also wanted you to know that we've been running the TV for about an hour now and using the solar, we have not depleted the battery at all. In fact, if our battery was depleted, the solar panels would actually be running the TV and charging the battery at the same time. 
All right, everybody, we are going to end our video here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you're looking for a TV, especially a 32 inch, remember this is a great deal from Best Buy right now. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.